Anybody else feel like they need to hibernate for the next, I don't know, till spring? Sounds like a great idea. Anyway, um, August is almost over with. We have four more days. Only a few more days left, and then September happens. And what happened to the year? I mean, July went by really slowly just because I was with Ember for the whole month. Um, but I swear, like, a week ago, it feels like a week to two weeks ago, I was up in Austin um, because my nephew had his eighth birthday. And I have a hair. I'm like, there we go. Okay. So, um, this is basically what I want to do in September. Um, it had to, to fluctuate a little bit. I had to move some stuff around because I was given some good advice about beta readers. Basically that I need to, I need to become one before I ask other people to be beta readers so that I know what to expect as a beta reader um so i'm not like piling everything on these people expecting them to drop everything just to read my stuff <sighs> i know that that's that's just too much um i had plan i had the idea so we don't go with plans i had the idea of giving people anywhere between three and five chapters and having questions and everything but now realizing it, um, after I go through edits, I'm going to have to reread it again. And I'm almost done. I have, technically, because I put in a full blank page, I have 147 pages. And I am on one page, I am on page 135 right now. So, that tells you where I'm at with that. Uh, and then I have to, all of the stuff, because I hand wrote it. Not really hand wrote it, but you know. So, all of the notes are handwritten, and then I need to put it on Scrivener, get it broken up into chapters, do all of that stuff. Um, I already have a couple of people that are excited to read it, so maybe I'll test it out early on them, see how that works. Yeah. Either way, the beta reader thing will have to get moved, which means that everything else with this book will be a little bit later but that's not a big deal because I don't have anything right now past beta readers for that um, anyway my um, my monthly goals are basically to keep working on people's princess for um, for September so I'm going to be taking a little bit more care and adding subtracting um, just editing and re revising in general so that I can make it somewhat, I can't say perfect, but I'm definitely not one of those people who goes through every chapter and, oh, hey, this sentence could be better. Oh, hey, I could put this word instead of this word and just constantly going around the same chapter trying to make it better and in the end just delete it. I've never, you know, it's, it's kind of like what you get is what you get. I'm so tired. <laughs> um, I'm trying to fight off this head cold and it's kept me up at night because I can't breathe and I have this stuff. My best friend. If it can even... There we go. That stuff and some nice Kleenex will get you everywhere. That and I have um, Dayquil and NyQuil stuff. So... Anyway, um, let me flip you down so that you can see this thing. Basically, this is my, um, my monthly version of the Happy Planner Notebook, which is really awesome. I'm going to flip you down so that you can see what, um, what it looks like. So I had um, taken away the, the other months on here just so that not really so it didn't bulk it up, but just so I know that I only have this much left and that's it. Basically, I didn't want to fight with it. I don't keep it because um, the documentation of that really doesn't matter to me. 
I know um, I have documentation of my word sprints and everything in a couple of other places, so that's not the biggest deal ever. So, um, I like this because it has um, gold trackers in here. It has highlights, birthdays, a couple of other things. Um, I got a little creative in it. This is the first day of fall, which I'm really excited about. Even though Starbucks says that yesterday, the 27th, was the first day of fall because they introduced their pumpkin spice lattes, which is fine. And Disney, <laughs> Disney did, um, Disney is starting to do Halloween. I think they did it last, they started last weekend? I can't remember. Either way, I, I love that fall and Halloween and everything is uh, getting earlier and earlier. That doesn't bother me at all. Um, I also did this for Patriot Day. So just little pictures, stuff like that. I really don't have anything major to put on here for September. Uh, monthly goals. Let me get a pen. Um, I don't really have... I mean, other than... Finish editing... So, finish editing, break down chapters, stuff like that. Um, which I know is incredibly vague. It's just, it's, it's not descriptive at all. And that's basically because I, I don't know, I don't know what else to put with it. I guess that I can, um... What I'm doing basically after I after I figure it out after I like mark it up with the red pen and the highlighters and everything then I um, I'll put it in Scrivener I'll break it down into chapters and go from there and then I'll be doing my read again which will basically be the first read for me where it's all as completed as it can be for the first draft and then I'll be writing questions every couple of chapters for beta readers. That way, um, whenever I send that off, they have questions to answer, basically. Rather than, because um, I don't want to ask them, you know, did you like it? Stuff like that, where it's just yes or no. I really would like some feedback. <laughs> um... Note to self, get better sleep. I think that's how you spell restful. I don't know if there are two L's in there or not. Hold on. Let me look. Nope. Just one L. Fantastic. Um, right now, and I don't know if it's because of the head cold or just... I, I don't know what it is, but I am just tired. And I have, for an example, last night we went to bed at 10.15. I didn't even read because I had NyQuil and I took my sleeping pill, which is melatonin and something else. I can't remember what it is, but it's fantastic. Um, but yeah, I don't think that I woke up at all during the night with the exception of like waking up to roll over which I wake up and roll over every time and it just or I wake up to roll over and it just really puts a damper on my night um I heard Nate's alarm and then I felt my alarm because mine is triggered by my watch so I'm it just I'm tired and I don't know why Blah. Um, so yeah, this is another thing that I will be working on is getting more restful sleep. So do I need to go to bed earlier than 10 o'clock? Do I need to, you know, it's just stuff like that. Um, and I can't seem to catch a break in general because either I am too, like I can't find the happy medium. I'm either too tired and I need a nap or I slept too much, which makes me tired and I need a nap. 
and at this point in time, I will sleep all day if I let myself. Yesterday, I um, came back home and went to bed, and I think I woke up at around noon. So that was an extra three hours of sleeping, which was crazy. It's just, ugh. And I shouldn't be doing that. Um, I don't really have anything to check off right now, only because everything's right there. Um, so I'll be adding on to this as I go. I don't really have anything to jot down. Um, I know that whenever the humidity dies down in the morning, we're going to have a little bit more of a routine. And by we, I mean me and the dog. So we'll be walking and everything else um so yeah I really I don't have anything to really write down here at the moment just because it's not September yet um top priorities are obviously to finish editing so putting it in Scrivener rereading to get questions things like that and then I did this, so if I have any notes, um, in which I will probably, whenever I get back to breaking it down into chapters, then I will do, like, chapter one through five. Things that are quick, that I can send, like, I'll break it, um, let me think this through. If I think that somebody can easily read, like, four chapters for the first chapters in a good amount of time because I don't want to take up their time but let me see three four so um well these are these are big pages these are regular printer out pages um standard size pages is that what they're called anyway like chapter four ends on page 11. So do I think really that people could do four, four of these chapters in one day? Then yeah. But then the next one, maybe five through seven, like seven might be a long chapter, I can't remember. So I might just do five and six. So we'll see how, how it goes, what I can manage, and what I think that other people can manage. Yeah. Um, and then I'll probably write it down here as soon as I get to that point. And then I have them all, all numbered. So let me bring you back up to me. It's hard finding that perfect medium again. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, so it's just, it's things that I'll be writing down for breaking down of chapters and everything else. I know what I want to do, it's just writing it down is a totally different thing. And like I said, I'd honestly rather be sleeping. But I want to get this out and I want to get it done. And it's not me hating it, I want to get it done, it's just I, I need to get it done. Because um, October and November depend on me having this pretty much polished up. Um, October and November basically that's, I need to get this done in order for that to work. Um, and I'll be doing a lot in October. I have a lot planned, so we'll see how that goes. It'll also be cooler outside, so maybe I can get some of it done outside. I don't know. I'm ready for fall. I'm ready for, God, I wish I was a bear so I could hibernate. Mm. Anyway, um... That is my my September intentions. That's what I want to do. I will be editing um, instead of getting beta readers by the beginning middle of the month. Um, it probably won't be until after NaNoWriMo, maybe even the beginning of the year. Just because I want to make sure that I can develop a... Um, some sort of relationship with the humans that are going to be beta reading for me and so that I can make sure that everything is 
as perfect for them as they as it can be before it goes into beta reading so that somebody doesn't look at this and go this is a piece of crap why why am I reading this there's so many errors whenever I'm not looking for them to proofread or anything I just want them to read the story but if those errors are what's hanging them up then it's going to be a problem and I want it to be as perfect for them as I can before it goes out to them so yeah that's about it um if you have any questions what are your September intentions do you have anything planned for September yet or are you just winging it um are you prepping for preptober or are you just kind of embracing the um the fall or the fact that it's gonna be fall because it's still hot here it's oh it's not as bad as it was in in like January but man I'm January holy cow it's not as bad as it was in July but yeah oh my gosh I need to do something man my Lola <laughs> but anyway um let me know what you're doing for September if you have a video um then post it down below so that I can watch it or you can find a way to tag me in your video I guess I don't know either way I want to know what you guys are doing maybe um Maybe I need to change what I'm doing, and yeah, I don't know. I still have a couple of days before September gets here, so we'll see how it goes. Um, anyway, I hope you had a really great August, and I hope that um, September is nice to you, too. 